was very, very good Android here. So, for years, Samsung Space Zoom capable phones have been known for their ability to take incredibly detailed photos of the moon. But more recently, a Reddit post revealed that Samsung is basically faking zoom photos of the moon. Well, what actually happened is that a Reddit user was ingenious in its simplicity. Well, he created an intentionally blurry photo of the moon, displayed it on the computer screen, and then photographed this image using the Samsung's Galaxy S23 Ultra. As you can see here, this is the photo which he showed with no detail at all, plus blurry, and boom. Here is the result after processing it in the Samsung's Galaxy S23 Ultra's camera, but it showed a crisp and clear photograph of the moon. The Samsung's Galaxy S23 Ultra added details that simply weren't present before. There was no upscaling of blurry pixels and no retrieval of seemingly lost data. There was just a new moon, a fake one. But to make things clearer, I tried both ways. I took a bunch of photos of real moons using the Samsung's Galaxy S23 Ultra and side by side, I tried to display a blurry picture of the moon in my laptop and I captured it, but honestly speaking, nothing happened at all. And guys, this is not happening for the first time though. People have been asking questions about Samsung's moon photography ever since the company unveiled a 100x space zoom feature in its S20 Ultra in 2020. Some have accused the company of simply copying and pasting pre-restored textures onto images of the moon to produce its photographs. But Samsung says the process is more involved than that. Samsung further says that no image overlaying or texture effects are applied when taking a photo, but that the company uses AI to detect the moon's presence and then offers a detail enhancing function by reducing blurs and noises. Samsung simply says it uses a detail improvement engine function to effectively remove noise and maximize the details of the moon to complete a bright and clear picture of the moon. And guys remember, Huawei was also accused on the same topic and they were saying the same thing. And I guess Huawei was right. Companies have to do some major processing to make the moon clearer in the smartphone photography. But when it comes to this Reddit user experiment, I would say this is bad. Like if it actually happened though? then I can clearly say that Samsung's high AI processing is creating moon pictures itself like the fake one when it can't actually capture it clearly. So yeah, what do you think about it? Well, let me know your thoughts on this in the comments down below. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.